Welcome back to another video. If you're new to my channel, welcome. In this video, I'm going to be trying out the new BT Art Box Ombre Nail Tips. So they came out with two different shades, peach and pink. Um, so these are the different options that they have for them. They have short and long lips, square, coffin, almond. So yeah, they sent me two of theirs to try out. So I'm going to start off by unboxing them. And the first pair that I have are the long pink. And these are like my favorite. These are literally so pretty. It's what I decided to use for my set for this video. So yeah, I'm just going to go in and open those up. So this is what it looks like right out of the packaging. It's like a matte ombre, but the ombre is so perfect, like much better than anything I would be able to do on my own. So I was super excited about that. And then these are the short square in the shade Peach. Um, so these are like more of a nude shade than the pink, but I love these also. They're super cute. And this is like their more rounded square shape, um, which is like you could still shape it up and get that like nice sharp square if that's the look you were going for. But this is what it looks like. Still really pretty. Has a nice gradual ombre to it. But I think I just prefer the longer length just because you get more of the white on it. But yeah, um, they also sent me their x Coat Tips French Protecting Duo. Um, so of course you get the J glue on um, which if you were doing the gel x method you would use that to adhere the tips and then it also came with a builder gel and top coat So to start off my set, I'm just going to size out all of my nail tips and I actually decided to make this as just like a quick press on set rather than using the gel X method and I just wanted to show just how easy it is to do it even if you didn't have time to do the full gel X method, prep your nails, all that good stuff, you could just make these as press ons by just going in with some top coat over it and it's just super quick and easy and it still looks super flawless. So yeah, I'm just going to go in and size out all of my nail tips and put them on my my nail stand and then I'll check back in. Once I have all of the nails sized out, I'm just going to go in with the nail file and file the very tip of the nail. I'm just holding it out in front of me and just kind of making it where the side of the nail file that's closest to me is like pointing downward towards my lap. And it just makes for like a nicer square shape. Um, it's still already pretty perfect, but I just like to do that. And it just takes a little bit of the length, but not too much. And it just makes it look so nice and crisp. So yeah, just going to go in and top coat the nails really quick just doing one even coat and then I'm going to cure them in the lamp. While I have the nails carrying in the lamp, I'm just going to go in with some peel off base coat, just putting a thin coat of that on each nail. To apply them, I'm going to be using the BT Art Box nail glue. I love their nail glue, it's really good. 
I'm just gonna go in and put some on the inside of the fake nail as well as a little bit on my natural nail and just press it and hold it into place for a few seconds. Now that I have them all on, this is the finished product. I just went in with a little bit of cuticle oil and that was pretty much it. So it's so pretty. I feel like these really look like acrylic, like even more so than their French tip version. So I'm excited to see what other color options they end up coming out with for the ombre. And yeah, I have a link in the description box to their website as well as my coupon code for them. And I'll see you in the next one.